Dean Williams here. It's an old school cover. Stuck Magazine back in the day. Kind of ages me with the brownness of the uh, paper there. <laughs> yeah. But um, I remember this. I think uh, Andrew Hutchinson shot it. Hutch? Yep. Back in the day, salad. It's like a 10 stair rail or something. Kind of oversized 10 in, um, I believe it was in Milwaukee. Um, I don't really remember this day because that was obviously so long ago. Yeah. But uh, I know I, I used to have salads down really good, like way better than 5 O's. So I used to just sell it like every rail that I could go to. Um, the front side salad was like a super hot trick. It was trending at that time. So um, I definitely beat it down a lot of rails. So I was, I was really stoked I got this cover. Um, especially being like a little kid from the Midwest. Were like, you living in Chicago? Yeah, I was living in Chicago at the time. So just like seeing this, this is like one of my first kind of photos in the mag. Like obviously look at my hair. Like I probably had Very to be sure like hair. 18 or something, 19, 20, I don't know. Had you, yeah. had you been getting hooked up at this point? Um, I'm sure I had like shop sponsors yeah. and stuff, you know? Shop sponsors, maybe like a flow or something, but um, we just did it like how we do it. Today, same thing, just go out, filmer, photographer, friends, and we just skate and try to do things that haven't been done on spots. Yep, yep. Very cool. Do you remember seeing it for the first time? No. No. But I, I remember being stoked, though. I, Hell yeah. I was always stoked on this. This is like such a sick rail because it's like a big, one side's big, but you can't like hit it from that side. Ah. So it just makes the rail kind of look bigger. So I, I always like that. It's like kind of against the wall. Right. Well, that was sick. Cool. And then what do we have here? So this is my uh, Transworld skateboarding cover. Um, this was on a super trip. Um, we did like a residency in New York. Um, we we're staying in Brooklyn. This is like a long day of skating. We found this gap, this rock. <laughs> it's kind of like the size of kind of like a mini table in a way. Like, yeah. Kind of long. It's not as high as a mini table. What you had to do was ollie up a ledge and then quickly adjust your feet and then go over this gap plus a big rock. I remember this heel flip taking all day and like the summer of New York, my shirt was just drenched in sweat. I was like fatigued, dizzy, like no food in me and I just like could not get this heel flip for the life of me. And I finally got it and um, CU Trin actually shot this photo. Yeah. And we were super stoked on the photo back in the uh, the place we were doing the residency at. That, uh, yeah, I mean, I was so stoked when they, su they surprised me actually at the uh, ASR. Remember those trade uh, yeah, shows? Yeah, yeah, awesome. Yeah, so they like had this big old poster Post and they like surprised me with it. And I was like super stoked because I didn't think I was going to get the cover. Um, this is like my only transworld cover. So, yeah, it's definitely one of my favorites. And it's a heel flip, so. Definitely love Trademark. It. Trademark. Old Faithful. <laughs> yeah. Old Faithful. Whose magazine was that? Who, this got, is, who uh, got this actual copy? Oh shit, John Mata. Yeah. <laughs> My boy John Mata. John. Block his address. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> John Mata's magazine, actually. That's so sick. And where, where are we this weekend? We're in Arizona, Phoenix, Arizona, the home of John Mata. Yeah. So we're stoked. Hopefully we get to run into him. You're out for the Slow Impact uh, seminar? Yeah, Slow Impact seminar. We'll be talking about uh, sobriety and skateboarding. Oh, Red, you're doing yeah. that, Kristen. So Good. that'll be fun. I'll be up on the uh, panel tomorrow and just hanging out and skating and having a good time. Perfect. Any classic covers that ring uh, really familiar in your head from when you were a younger skater? Any friends that had covers that stuck out for you? Mm got me on the spot <laughs> the brain's not there right now um let me see let me see i mean first mag you had saw as a kid did jamie foy have the cover for that front crook down to 20. he did right well he had he had them like four months apart yeah um i feel like he had didn't he have a cover for it yeah I like to only know like the most recent one, That's cool. which is Felipe's Kipo Front One on the oh, 16th God, for Crasher. Uh... That's how like my Cur brain goes. Current events. Current events. That's, <laughs> That's, That's how cool. my brain goes. I remember that Kipo Front One, Felipe. Um, but yeah. <laughs> That's good. Awesome, yeah. man. That about covers it, Neen. Thanks for getting together with us. Thank you, man. Yeah. Appreciate you.